Hey guys, Janelle here. Welcome back to my channel and Happy New Year! I'm coming at you for the first time in 2021 and I'm really excited. A lot of people have mixed feelings of uh, this year because obviously a lot of the issues that we had in 2020 have trickled over to this year. It doesn't go away just like that. But I do have a really, really like op like optimistic view of what this year is bringing because a lot of good things are already happening but those good things only come because we're working on them right so today i want to start off on a really positive vibe and i want to share with you guys the great things that i've got going on right here and my january winter favorites so let's get started So I'm gonna start off with my current favorite skincare products because my skin, and I'm sure a lot of you out there too, um, skin is raging with all of this dryness. So if you're in Texas, the weather is super up and down. Like one day, like today, it'll be 70, and then tomorrow it'll go down to 30 and start to snow all of a sudden. So this, my skin is really affected by it, and my face needs a lot of love. So I'm gonna share a couple of my favorite skincare products that I'm currently loving. So one thing that I have, and I probably have shared this with you before from my Grove Collaborative um, subscription box, and I've loved it. So Orgade Sheet Mask, this one has vitamin C, and honestly, I love it. This is my Sunday ritual, so I order a couple at a time now. Um, of course, they're vegan and cruelty-free, and they are organic, yes. And then this one is the Rejuvenating Under Eye Gel Masks. Love these, they reduce puffiness, and they're like my favorite thing in the world. I've used several different eye masks, and these are by far my favorite. Totally worth the price tag on it. So, Something that's really been helping my skin a lot is getting regular facials. And I go to my favorite spa here in San Antonio, and they have two locations actually. And they are Creme de la Creme Vegan Wellness. They are the one and only vegan wellness skincare and spa franchise in the nation. And so they carry this brand, it's called Circadia. These are my little sample sizes. <laughs> this is Circadia, and this is a brand that, um, that is a luxury skincare brand, and then they exclusively design vegan skincare line for creme de la creme wellness. And so I get my facials with them. I'm telling you guys, it is the most blissful thing I've ever experienced in the spa. So fantastic, and my skin always looks like it's glowing after I'm done with them. So I've got a couple of samples here of my favorite products, but just know that as soon as these samples are done, I have to buy the product. And so I usually use like a range of skincare products that range from, from drugstore brands to mid-range, and I would say that this is mid to high. So this brand, for example, the Milk Cleanser, which is my favorite cleanser I've ever used and super great on my skin. My, my skin tends to go towards the dry end and it's delicate, but it works. And this cleanser would go for around $40 to $45. So I can have like a $10 skin cleanser or a $45 skin cleanser and I do see the difference, honestly. This, this one is amazing. Um, I also have their daytime control. This is the um, the moisturizer for daytime and then the moisturizer for nighttime. And I love their um, their serum. This is called the Chrono Calm. I know they're so tiny. I'll probably do a close up a little bit later so you can see. So right now this, this brand I'm loving and again, I'm getting regular facials. So if you're in the San Antonio area or Hill Country area, let me know, I've got a little discount for you. For any service that you would like, you would get 10% off using my code. And I will leave that down in the description box. <laughs> All right, so what else am I loving on my skin? Okay, so this is for facial as well. This is a handmade scrub 
by a local brand, a local company called Dewey Organics, and she hand makes everything from serums to body oils and scrubs. This one, as you can see, it's been used. This one has red clay and um, Himalayan sea salt. It's got little, what are these little seeds? I feel like they're poppy seeds, but I'm not super sure. Um, and flowers too. Like I love this scrub and I use it on my face or my body. It's one of the best that I've ever used. And for my lips, you guys, my lips get so chapped and so bad, like it cracks, I could bleed if I'm not taking care of it. So um, I know I showed this before, but I hadn't used it before. This is the Butter Me Up Organics Chocolate Lip Scrub, as you can see, I've been using it. And I got this one at our fam, the, um, the website that I told you guys that curates all of these sustainable, eco-friendly products that go from home to beauty to fashion, a whole lot of things that I'm obsessed with. So current obsession, lip scrub in the winter is a must. What else? Face. Okay, so this one in particular, this is a hyaluronic acid by Grace and Stella, and I got this one in one of the cause boxes, but I hadn't used it. So when you saw it, when I unboxed it, now I've used it, obsessed. I love it. It is a little bit more liquidy than other hyaluronic acids that I've used, and it works so well. I'm really, really loving this one. And I'm using this serum by Organically Bath & Beauty. I love them and I use them on my face and my body. So I probably have showed this before, but I really wanna talk about the importance of this serum on my, on my skin. So I'll get really dry patches in different areas and like right under my brow. It's really annoying where it gets um, flaky and I don't have a known skin issue, but that flakiness is very similar to psoriasis, the way it looks, so, you know, I have to be on it. Because if I, if I wear makeup, even if I moisturize, I'll still get that flakiness during the winter time. So this serum has helped me so much in avoiding those flaky patches, and I love it, I'm obsessed with it. And also from Organically Bath & Beauty, I received from them very recently and I'm dying of obsession <laughs> with this line. This is their luxury rose quartz line and it's amazing. I don't know all of the properties of quartz, but I'm learning rec like recently, I'm starting to learn about it. I recently went to a sound bath therapy session and there was quartz and amethyst involved and I just felt so much better, like it was such a positive vibe. And whenever um, Organically Bath & Beauty sent me these products, they also sent me like a little, a little chunk of um, rose quartz and I keep it next to my bed. And honestly, recently I've been sleeping much better. I'll have to like research a little bit more about quartz so that I can explain it to you, but it does have properties that ground you. So that much I can tell you. So um, they've uh, developed this luxury rose quartz bath, um, bath gel. And then there is the whipped body mousse, which I have from another, with another scent, the rosewood scent, and I'm obsessed with it. This is so good for my skin, like my legs, you guys are so, so dry, it's ashy. So when I use this right after the shower, I'm telling you, it's a huge difference and my skin is thanking me for it. It's very, very hydrating and nourishing. Um, so also with body, uh, I've been using the Paloma Verde. This is a local CBD brand and they have products that are THC free. So I use their CBD, um, tincture and I also have used the gummies. Love them, they're so delicious. <laughs> and they mellow me out quite a bit. But I've also been using their um, the body, the salve. So I use that in particular when I have muscle aches after a very intense workout. So um, I'll just apply it in the affected area and I'm telling you like I feel like it just goes away. It, I feel like it melts away the discomfort and the pain and the, and the muscle tense, tension that I have. So I really love their salve. Um, I have a discount code, so I'll be leaving that for you in the description box. Also, for hands and body and all that, 
I've been using the Grove Collaborative hand sanitizer. Everyone's using hand sanitizer these days. So I have this one and I'll put it in a smaller bottle as well so I can carry it with me. So this one has um, coconut oil in it. So it's more moisturizing. I don't know about you guys, but my hands are so dry. It looks like I work outside like with my hands and you know, I don't. So the dryness of my hands is obviously because of the constant use of sanitizer. So this one has helped me a lot and it smells really good. This one is blood orange scent. Oh yeah, it smells good. It doesn't smell like alcohol and that makes me happy. And yeah, that's it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and tell me your friends. <laughs> That's all for today. Until next time, thanks for watching, and yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.